celebrating and appreciating nonprofits. I'm Jill Horner. This is Comcast Newsmakers. With me this hour is John Moore. He's Vice President of Resource Development and Strategic Partnerships for the United Way of Delaware. Thanks so much for being with us. I'm honored to be here. When we talk about what you do as an organization, there, there's a national theme at this point, and you focus on education, income, and health. How does that break down and impact people here in Delaware? Well, those are three critical areas. We deal a lot with our youth. We also deal with families. And when you think about health, we deal with a lot with our seniors and the uninsured. And so those three key areas, in one way or another, impact everyone. Kind of goes along with our theme, Live United. And so by addressing education, income, and health, we're able to reach out to all of the citizens of Delaware, carry out our mission of maximizing the community's resources to improve the quality of life for all Delawareans. Now you work at a state level, but you work with local organizations at a grassroots level who really have their pulse on what's happening in local communities. Why are these partnerships important? Well, you know, they're the persons who really know what's going on. Um, it's wonderful that we could work at the level that we do, but at the end of the day, it's those persons that's living in those communities that know the hurts and the pains that need to be addressed. And so by being able to work with grassroots nonprofits, we're able to really diagnose some of the problems that are in our community. And by partnering with them, with the United Way and those organizations, we're able to really come to some solutions. Many people are familiar with the United Way through your annual campaign of giving, your annual contributions, workplace contributions, for example. But now you're working year-round right. as an organization. What does that difference in fundraising strategy actually mean for, for the United Way? Well, one of the things that's very key with us is we believe in what's called advancing the common good. And that involves three things, give, advocate, and volunteer. People typically are used to us showing up around September for the campaign, but now we're doing it all year because people are hurting uh, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, but actually 365 days a year. And those needs need to be met. And so we're asking people to give not just in September through December, but throughout the year. Along with that is to advocate we need to hear your voice. We need to know the issues that are out there. And so we're reaching out to people to be a voice for United Way. And a key area is volunteerism. All year long, our agencies need help, school districts need help, and uh, some of the organizations that we deal with. And so by volunteering, we're able to help people 365 days a year. And we can actually contact you and find the right volunteer opportunity for us, something that fits our individual wants and needs and interests. Absolutely. We have a website called Give Back Delaware. And what that is, is it matches up people with those very needs that they want. You may like to work with children. Uh, you may want to work with the elderly. And so by going back to givebackde.org, what it is that you can find the exact match that you're looking for. We've ad actually matched up some of our companies already with some of the areas that they want to work in. Now you mentioned companies and obviously uh, contributions through the workplace make a big difference. Have you seen an impact because of the economy on workplace contributions? Well, what's phenomenal is last year we met our goal, actually exceeded our goal. And it was a tough time. But I think what happened was people really put a face on those that were hurting. At one time they were giving, but not really sure of who they were giving to. But now they know someone that's lost a job, who can't feed their children. And so because of that need and that urgency, people really stepped up. All so right. it was a great year. And, and we're also talking about celebrating the mm -hmm. work that has been done. Even though there has been this increasing demand and need for services, people have really stepped up to the plate, including nonprofits. And on the 24th of June, at your annual meeting, you're really celebrating that work. And that's just what it is. It's a grand celebration. We're going to have music and media that's going to be full of excitement about the great year that we had. We're going to bring in some of those nonprofits and celebrate them for the work they did and also for the leadership in the United Way and saying thank you. And for everyone who's even watching this program today, we say thank you because if it wasn't for your contributions and your service, we would not be able to touch the community the way that we are. Okay, and again, the United Way of Delaware's annual meeting is the 24th of June at the Delaware Theater Company on the Wilmington waterfront at 5 p.m. So if people are interested, they can visit your website for more information about that. And in the last few seconds, you mentioned it's a year-round campaign at this point, so people can get involved at any point. Absolutely, and it doesn't matter age, anyone that wants to get involved, contact us. You can go on our website, you can go to the telephone and call us. And if there's something that you want to help with, United Way seeks your assistance. Thanks so much. Thank you. We've been talking with John Moore. I'm Jill Horner for Comcast Newsmakers.